This is my first ever comedy. This is my first ever comedy. This is my first ever... I mean, this is one of the reasons why, when I got the script, I was like, okay, this is not my normal type of thing, and not really always my sense of humor, but like, how could I miss out on the chance to work with some of the best, like, the, the most impressive lineup of the best comedians that there are basically in the world right now? How could I not want to go along for a week and just like see what I could learn and see what I could pick up and, um, you know, how can I, how can I say no, really? Yeah. It's kind of an amazing opportunity. So, party at James Franco's house, there's an apocalypse. The earth opens up and swallows up pretty much everyone at the party. For some reason, I make it, and these six guys make it. Um, they run back inside to James Franco's house, they board the thing up, and they, they're like, right, we're gonna stay here until the apocalypse is over, until everything's safe. And um, I managed to make it to a McDonald's and I live off ketchup packets and sour and sweet packets and I live in a drain pipe and I eat rats and um, anyway I start getting afraid and I and I try and I, and I basically bust into into Franco's house and uh, I think that you know I'm safe now and I have this refuge but then but then things get crazy and I don't <laughs> want to give too much away but things get crazy. It was definitely crazy, and obviously the biggest problem I have is that I find everything so funny that is, is trying not to laugh all the time. That's really, really hard. When people are saying the craziest things and you just have to keep playing it straight, it's very, very hard.